Thank you, Ronak. Uh, well, firstly, compliments to uh, Exchange for Media. I've known Ronak for some time, and uh, I think he's one of the reasons that I come here. Uh, comes across uh, as a very nice person. What? That's wrong, is it? No, that's right. Oh, thank God. <laughs> You see, friends are those who are, who are available to you at odd hours. Once I gave him a call at 1 o'clock in the night, I said, come now. And he came. <laughs> but uh, I think being in the ministry, one of the, the most wonderful things is to meet with people like all of you, who are really experts, who are really, very really creative people, have achieved things in their own life. Uh, that's, that's a great thing for me to come, come across and meet all of you. Today, we may not get much time to really sit and uh, Talk, but I do get these opportunities when such people like you come down to my office. Uh, I may have been very bad in my own PR, but the government has given me the responsibility of its public relations. And uh, once in INB, one gets to, we have these uh, lots of opportunities where we have to create advertisements for the work that the government is doing. And that's when I also learned about the out of home entity advertisements. Uh, out of home? Yeah, the billboards, simply to be put. Uh, I realize how challenging it is that uh, you want to put in as much content in it because there's so much to talk about what you have done. I'm sure the same is the case with all the companies. Uh, but at the end of the day, you have to put in a message because the time is so short. You're competing. It's actually not a fair competition between uh, advertisements that go on television or advertisements that go on radio. Uh, compared to advertisements that are on a billboard. I mean, I just learned that thankfully there is a good market for you because of the traffic jams. But uh, there's always that very small window of opportunity for somebody to look up at a billboard. And there is no sound, there is nothing else, just a visual aspect. Uh, I also noticed that uh, some of the advertisements of the government, I find, are at very nice uh, locations. Invariably, you, you're stuck in a traffic jam with a traffic light and you see a, an Air Force advertisement. I've never ever uh, missed that advertisement at near the Prime Minister's house which says that you know, if, you, if you can decide for your, your career in the next two seconds, then Air Force is it for you. I always see that. That's a great location. And then there's another location where I've always never been able to see that advertisement of one of the state governments. It's on a roundabout. And they put an LED there. And the LED is giving out the number of people who have uh, uh, who are taking advantage of the government schemes. So the, the LED is moving all the time. It's the numbers are rolling. It's been three years. I haven't been able to read any of the numbers. <laughs> you see, it's on a roundabout. I didn't look on a traffic light. I would have stopped. It's on a roundabout. 